Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Lillian and today is a very exciting video. We are doing a luxury bag haul. Um, I am very into luxury everything, luxury bedding, luxury bags, fashion. I would like to get into luxury fashion but being plus size it's not really an option. Um, very few places do that. So you know I splurge on my bags and my shoes. And my birthday is in a couple weeks, so I thought, why not? No better time than the present to treat yourself. If you're not going to treat yourself, who is? So I got two bags, one from Miss Dior and one from Miss Prada. I have them in the dust bags. I'll show you the Prada one first because I actually took her out for a spin today, and she was just, she was just incredible. Just a sweet, sweet angel girl. So here she is. This is the Prada 2005 re-edition bag. I'm reading this just to make sure I pronounce it right. It has this little focus on her. It has this little tag where it says it here. So this was their famous style of bag back in the day. And they brought her back but made her leather and just gorgeous. This type of style bag is really popular if you've seen the Louis Vuitton one um, with having the little mini bag connected. I just love this bag because it's so versatile you can wear this one every day or you can take these straps off and wear this one just like this like an evening bag okay over the shoulder cross body all of that i love it so much and then you see this at first and you're like okay lily what fits in there you can put a credit card in there your airpods a lip gloss a hand sanitizer like this can be very useful and once again like all of these things can be taken off you can put this in another bag i really think it's going to be great for like when i'm going out to the bars obviously not right now but when i can again and you're like at the bouncer and he's like give me your id you can just grab it really quick or if you're just like running in for errands and you can and grab it really quick <laughs> really elevates you, any type of look you got going on as you can see i'm a very simple dresser i don't do anything crazy so just putting this on my outfit adding it to my outfit really just elevates my whole look and it fits a lot i'm a mini bag person most of my bags are mini bags because i just carry my phone my keys my card holder a lip gloss and then my mask and a hand sanitizer like nothing too crazy unless i'm like going um to a coffee shop to work in that case i take a tote but this is what it looks like inside i just have my card holder in there right now i have my car keys and then you can put your phone. I have the iPhone something max. Put it in there. And then you still have literally so much room. Like you can fit a small water bottle in there. Oh, I just love it so much. My new baby. Second bag I'm going to show you. Oh, I'm going to tell you the price of this because I love watching these videos. And I really wish more people would just share the price because I'm going to look it up anyways. And you could just save me the 30 seconds by telling me. So this bag was um, $19.50. So with tax and stuff, it was like a little over $2,000. But I think that's good for the price. I know that's like so awful to say, but I do because it's so multifunctional. Day night day night like come on you can even take this off and just wear it as a little clutch little clutch moment um i just love it they do have this in their famous nylon prada is really known for their nylon but i'm just a leather girl and the nylon one comes in silver hardware and no like i need gold I have gold jewelry gold jewelry yeah that's why i got that one um the nylon one is though 700 dollars cheaper so if you like the style of this bag but um don't want to spend splurge that much i would definitely check out the nylon one next we're going over to miss dior this baby is so classy she's fluffy she's a little bit sassy you know she's basically me in a bag and she's pink so this is the diorama bag and she's so cute so i just said i like gold hardware but i decided to do something a little different with this one it has brass hardware as you can see and this is like the most satisfying thing ever ah oh, like listening to that sound 
wow I love her so she is lambskin so you have to be a little more delicate with her she will scratch more easily than this type of leather like this I can throw around this is such a great everyday bag but her you want to be you want to be a little gentle with her she reminds me of like a cancer and she reminds me more of a Virgo anyways so yeah I'll show you what it looks like inside this one has a lot of space um it has a zip pocket back there it has another pocket right here i just have a lip gloss in there right now and then i always keep my authenticity card in here because you just don't want to lose it especially like if you're gonna resell it you definitely want to have that just to like authenticate that it is you know in fact a real bag i sometimes even keep my receipt to it so i can see like what i originally paid for it but yeah, I love the chain. Some people will just hold it like this or like this. Like, she has options. The only thing I would say is you kind of have to be careful. So right when I got her yesterday, I was like, I have to get a picture in her. So I was wearing black jeans. And later that night when I was cuddling with um, my sweet gal, I noticed that a little color transfer happened on the back. You probably... Ooh, I always focus on my face. You probably can't see it on camera. It's honestly not that big of a deal because I wiped it off right away. I can just still see it a little if I'm staring really hard. Um, wasn't a, that big of a deal to me because I was like, you know what? I knew when getting this, I did my research. Like, I know eventually she's going to get a scratch. Eventually she'll have a little color transfer. But I just think she's so beautiful that I just don't even mind. I love her so much. <laughs> so this bag was, oof. This is a $3,600. Oh, the wait, that's so cute. It says um, CD right here on the brass. Okay, I'm stalling. So this bag is $3,600. Um, definitely an investment piece. I also wanna be very cautious because I do know like we are in a pandemic and I'm very grateful that I still have my job and I've actually picked up more work. So um, I've, I'm just like very grateful that I'm able to like buy myself these bags but I know not everybody is and I just want to be you know I am aware of that and I see that and I know I was kind of shocked at myself for getting these studs because that's I honestly not really my style like I'm not I wouldn't call myself a stud girl but I just he thought it was a little edgy and fun and this bag is a little more um mature i would call it so i thought the studs like brought it down a little bit and yeah definitely not gonna be an everyday bag because she's lambskin but definitely like at night or if i just want to like you know be a little extra she will get some wear but yeah here are my birthday bags that i got myself i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you like these type of luxury hauls i am definitely one to splurge and i could definitely record more of these videos but i just want to know if you guys even enjoy seeing them if it like tickles your fancy just give me a comment below make sure you guys follow me on instagram and i will see you in my next video i love each and every one of you